What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Colorado Rockies versus Milwaukee Brewers Major League Baseball matchup going down Monday, July 1st, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com. Click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. Also, make sure you check out my 2024 Major League Baseball Grand Slam Season Pass. Now, this is for the betters that are betting $1,000 or more per game on Major League Baseball this season, but what it's going to get you access to is the weighting and rating of my plays for the first time. You're going to know where my biggest bets on the board are. It's also going to get you access to my nerfies and nerfies and my first five plays have been absolute money this season, as well as plays I make throughout the day based on things like line moves, money moves, pitching changes, and lineup changes. So if that sounds like something you're interested in and that's the kind of bankroll that you're working with, text Grand Slam to 443-780-5663. We'll get you some more information. But let's get to this one. Between the Colorado Rockies and the Milwaukee Brewers, the Colorado Rockies listing Austin Gomber as the starter in this one, while the Milwaukee Brewers have slated Bryce Wilson as the starter here. Now, Wilson, you know, coming in, has had his you know a, a fair share of issues this season, but a lot of those issues have come in the starter role. What we've started to see from the, uh, from the Milwaukee Brewers is they've implemented a bit of an opener strategy with Bryce Wilson, and for the most part, it looks like it's worked. I mean... The last few starts that Wilson's had as a true starter against the Padres gave up five earned runs in four and two thirds innings against the, the Padres on June 20th. A couple starts before that, or uh, excuse me, a couple uh, turns before that, gave up seven runs in, um, on six hits over four and a third innings of work against the Detroit Tigers. But you look at how he was used in a quote unquote relief arm or a long relief arm after an opener. You know, last time out against the Texas Rangers, six innings of three hit shutout baseball. You know, um, then before that, five and a third innings of, of three hit, no earned run baseball there as well. So if if the Brewers use Wilson effectively, he could have a solid outing. But now you go to Coors Field, where it's never easy to pitch as an opposing pitcher, and you have a 5.31 road ERA. Again, I want to see how Wilson is slated here, but he's slated to be the starter, which combined with his road ERA probably sets up to be not a good outing for, uh, for, for Bryce Wilson, if I'm being 100% honest. But... I'm really not looking to back Austin Gomber either. I mean, Gomber, you know, he was pitching well early on, but now he's starting to show signs of the Austin Gomber that we've been fading time and time again for the better part of the last couple seasons. He's given up at least four earned runs in each of his last four starts. The Rockies have dropped his last five outings. You know, when you look at his ERA in the uh, in the month of June, I'll tell you, it just really has not been anything to write home about for the uh, for the Colorado Rockies and for for Gomber himself, I mean he's been a big reason or was to why the uh, the Rockies have lost those games because the, the Rockies offense isn't good enough to be able to to bounce back when Gomber struggles early on as much as he has. And when you look at his ERA in the month of June, a nine point three nine ERA, you know, and at at home this season he does have a better home ERA at three point five seven. But again, we start to see that those those numbers start to regress, and I think he could have some issues here as well. Um, so I'm, I'm looking at the over here. I think the Brewers offense has been solid. I think at Coors Field, they get a boost, especially against Austin Gomber. But I think getting back home will be key for the Colorado Rockies, who always seem to play their better baseball at home, and especially if they can get to Bryce Wilson. So I'm going to go with the over between the Brewers and the Rockies, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.